Hello, my name is Steve Burgos. I'm a sophomore at the University of Texas at Dallas, majoring in finance and economics. This is my professional online portfolio. Um, on the left here, you have a picture of me and uh, my email. And also on the right, I have a letter to the viewer um, just explaining what the profession, uh, professional online portfolio is and uh, just a little bit about myself. And the next page is the About Me page. So I have a lot here on About Me. Um, that first link is a link to my resume. And the video here is a video just um, an elevator pitch. And on the left, I'll explain to you what an elevator pitch is uh, and uh, some, some of my interests. But also, uh, I'd like to point out on the top right, uh, on the very top right, I have uh, some quotes of um, some of my favorite business leaders that I've read about or just uh, been able to learn about the company. I have uh, Warren Buffett, you know, he's my favorite investor, uh, good long-term investor, uh, and value investor that I plan to model my investments one day. And uh, Walt Disney, uh, I really like Walt Disney because of his creativity and to bring uh, really a business from uh, an idea of uh, media production. And then Bill Gates, uh, I just think he's a really smart guy. And he's best friends, or he's really good friends with Warren Buffett, so that's why I uh, put him there. And on the, right here at the bottom right, you have uh, some of the things, uh, a link to some websites that uh, I believe represent me well. Alpha, it's an association for Latino professionals in finance and accounting. And actually, uh, this uh, summer I'll be going to New York for the annual convention. And uh, in the middle I have a link to Breaking into Wall Street. Uh, I use this to learn a lot about Excel and a little bit about financial modeling. Uh, I've had a good friend who, have, uh, who has let me use his account, so I don't have to pay for any of the courses, so that's good for me. And um, right here you have uh, a link to the Society of Actuarial uh, website. And I put this here because I really love risk management. And a lot of people think risk equals reward, and to some degree that is true. But uh, there's intelligent risk and really dumb risk that you can take. So the job of a risk manager is to uh, find out what are those dumb risks and not take those and take the intelligence so that risk does equal reward. And, uh, uh, right here I have my professional projects. Uh, my first project is an equity research project that was in my intermediate business finance class. Uh, we chose a company, uh, Club Corp. They recently, uh, recently went public in 2014, and we analyzed the company uh, using uh, EBITDA multiples and uh, comparable multiples and also uh, projecting financial statements and ultimately getting a discounted cash flow by an enterprise value and ultimately a, uh, an actual price. Uh, we ended up decided to buy the company because it's a really good company and it has good long-term prospects. And the second project is an organizational consulting, pro organizational consulting project. Uh, this was in my organizational behavior class. We went to professional uh, packaging services. Uh, they're the largest packaging service company for Frito-Lay. And we looked at their, uh, mainly their uh, manufacturing organization uh, the factory organization and uh, uh, find a good way to uh, structure the organization so that they could uh, increase their revenues. And on the last project at the bottom uh, is the entrepreneurial project. Really it was a uh, marketing project, but, uh, it, but also it was an entrepreneurial project because we, uh, the idea was to create a business and uh, to create a market plan for that business. And our business that my team chose uh, to create was a uh, BYOB, and that's uh, build your own box. So it, it's pretty much a toy company. Uh, make, we give uh, children uh, a sets of boxes, and then they can they can create castles or anything like uh, anything like that. And my job in the project was to uh, find out the financial uh, statements of the projected financial statements of the company, and also uh, look at market data. And I use a lot of this I use from current uh, toy companies such as Mattel and Hasbro. And uh, our last, uh, uh, it's actually uh, my contact information. So if you uh, want to contact me, you can email me or on the bottom, you can find my LinkedIn page and uh, connect with me. Thank you. Thank you.